Hello all you lovely people, welcome back to Fine and Fire. My name is Ramsey and today we're going to be cooking a Thai spiced tuna steak with a lovely fresh char grilled salad. Right, let's get going. First thing that we need to do is get the fire lit. So I'm going to get on that right now. Right, now we're going to give our tuna steaks a nice rub. I've got a nice Thai spiced rub here, so we're just going to sprinkle some of that on. We just want a nice coating. This is uh, from Angus and Oink, a great place to get your spices. And now a little bit of sesame oil, just on there. Already starting to look lovely. We're just going to pat that on there. Lovely. So you can put these in your fridge. And now we're ready to get on making a dressing. We're going to do a lovely satay dressing to go with the steaks and salad. Right. Right, now we're going to make this dressing. So first things first, garlic. We're going to slice this up nice and thin. I would say this is the elephant garlic again, but if you're using just normal garlic, which you probably are, use five cloves of garlic. We also have a couple of uh, lime leaves, two bird's eye chilies, and a thumb of ginger. We're going to chop this up nice and fine, put it into a pestle and mortar. If you have a blender, you can just blend it up. All right, we're about to make our dressing, which is gonna be a satay sauce for the salad. Uh, I will put all the measurements that you need on the screen, but I'll just let you know what we've got here. So we've got soy sauce, we've got some finely chopped shallots, got some lemongrass, tamarind, sugar. I've just got normal sugar, I couldn't get any palm sugar, but you would like to use palm sugar. We've got some sesame oil, coconut milk, we've got some rice vinegar, and we've got some fish sauce and some peanut butter. All right, so we're gonna start off this dressing by frying off all the shallots. Okay, so let's get on it. All right, guys, I'm doing this outside. I've got a nice kettle here, so I'm gonna cook it out here. You guys can perfectly find to do it inside. First things first, going in with a couple of tablespoons of sesame oil. And then we're gonna go in with our shallots and lemongrass. We're going to sweat these off until it's nice, nice and coloured. After that, we're going to add our paste, which we made earlier in the pestle and mortar. And then once we get a nice fragrancy on that, we're going to add our peanut butter, coconut milk, soy sauce, fish sauce and then we'll let it reduce. In with the sugar.
All right, once your sauce is nice and thick, you wanna add your peanuts. All right, I've cut up the bok choy, the broccoli, and I've uh, got the corn as well. I've seasoned it all with some Thai spice, and I've also done it with some sesame oil. I've also got here some radishes, with a little bit of rice wine vinegar on them, limes and lime zest for garnish. I'm now going to start cooking these tuna steaks. Right, in go the tuna steaks on a really hot grill. These only need about a minute on each side and then they'll be perfect. They are looking lovely. We'll get ourselves a nice board to let these rest on. That lovely. And now in with the corn. You can use pre-cooked stuff if you'd like. Just finishing up, placing up, I've put the satay sauce in the middle, just made a little ring of all the veg that we've cooked. And now I'm just gonna place on the lovely tuna. Now obviously this is just for one person. You can do this bigger, smaller. I'm just showing you how I'm gonna have it for myself. There we go, that's my tuna salad.